understand before we cross. Then I have to go alone. I'm afraid because with my leg condition, I'm scared to scared, scared to have fall. Also when I walk, then my back pain. It's my time in the hospital take very long time as to walk, to a place to see, because need some rest, more rest. So my appointment one day before they were call me that they had to take me on my appointment so they will come before one hour. So after get this request, then my appointment time all easy, very fast to see the doctor and appreciated their help now. Actually, when I received the aid, uh, I, I don't know how uh, comfortable would, would that be for me, you see, whether they'll be in time and whether I'll get uh, a, uh, someone to help me in bringing me to the hospitals and all that. But uh, I'm very fortunate that I have all this, you see, to bring me to the hospitals, you know, they gave me a, a chevron to help me out throughout the, you know, the appointment and also from my home, they help me until I, in the hospital. Sometimes I need to go, just go during the, like, get lunch for myself. Of course, there are many people who need their support, volunteers to help people who are disabled, you see. And uh, we will be very happy if they can come forward to help us. I'm Vicky's mom. My name is Punita. I'm 71 years old and uh, Vicky is a special child because she's a disabled person. Since birth he has been like that. You see, so because of his hydrocephalus and he's also a CP, cerebral palsy. So right now he's already 40 years old but he still needs assistance. You see, like bathing and then Piloting, all this he needs help. He cannot do it himself. Thank God I found this place. As I grow older, I don't have the strength anymore already. So, DAC is like a you know, opening for me now, I should say. It's a blessing that you know, he went to DAC. Vicky is a very friendly person who loves to be around people. He has a great relationship with most of the staff here at DAC. We help him with his necessities and guide him with his daily activities such as physical exercise to help him with his mobility and muscle strength. We are glad Vicky has been showing interest in all his activities. Sometimes it is really the simple acts from us that bring joy and meaning to them. And for us, the most rewarding moment is to see the joyful faces of our beneficiaries.